A movie sparked by one of San Diego's most notorious crimes is premiering right now in the gas lamp. The murder of Chelsea King led to a change in California law, and now a documentary by King's brother aims to make that change national. 10 News reporter Allison Ash is live downtown where the film is playing right now. Allison. Yeah, in fact, it's going to start in just a minute. Tyler King and his parents just walked this red carpet just a little bit ago. But if you take a look over here, check this out. There is a huge demand for this movie tonight. It is a sellout crowd, people who are waiting to get inside the theater to see this new documentary about Chelsea and about other victims of violent crimes, which is being shown on the big screen here. Now, Tyler told me making the documentary has made him whole again. I couldn't ask for a better way to come out of my tragedy. Um, so it's, it's just been an incredible experience and I'm so thankful for it. Tyler King is a young man who is once again feeling good about the world. Four years ago, his sister Chelsea went out for a run and never came home. Chelsea's Light, a brother's journey, shows how Tyler has come to terms with Chelsea's violent death at the hands of John Gardner. In the movie, he talks with the brothers and sisters of other victims. It just let me kind of face what I, what I went through and right, right up here. I mean, I, I really had to look it right in the face and, and that's truly in itself a way to get out of something like that. So um, I, I'm not, I wasn't afraid of it and I wasn't running from it anymore. Tyler. On the red carpet, Tyler and his family were upbeat. It's a much different picture than the one San Diegans all shared after Chelsea's death. What would Chelsea say if she were here tonight? She'd probably say, Tyler, tuck your shirt in. <laughs> no, she, um, she'd be so proud of her baby brother. Kidding aside, Kelly King says she couldn't be more proud of her son for facing his tragedy and trying to make something good come of it. This happens way too, too often, and if people aren't able to respond and relate to it, they're not going to do anything about it. And I, I do think that this documentary will hit a nerve with, with a lot of people that will encourage them to not be complacent, get up and do something. And this big night on the red carpet is being followed up by a really big day tomorrow. That is the day when the Kings will take their only son up to Oregon and drop him off at college. We're live downtown. Allison Ash, 10 News.